Hello, today I want to share a story with you called Hawaii for Wadney Watt by Helen Lester, illustrated by Lynn Munsinger. And we would like to say a special thank you to Houghton Mifflin for allowing us to share this story today. Hawaii for Wadney Watt. Poor Wadney, Wadney Watt. His real name was Rodney Rat, but he couldn't pronounce his R's. To make matters worse, he was a rodent. A rodent. What's your name, Wadney? Other students would ask. Wadney Watt, whispered Rodney. What's another name for a bunny? They asked knowingly. Wabbit, he mumbled. And how does a train travel? They winked at each other. A twain travels on twain tracks, Wadney said miserably. All of this teasing day in and day out made Wadney the shyest rodent in his elementary school. His squeak could barely be heard in class. He gnawed lunch alone. And while the other rodents scurried and scooted out to recess, Wadney hid inside his jacket. Then one day, as the rodents were taking turns doing wheelies, a new rodent, a very large rodent, barged into the classroom and announced, My name is Camilla Capybara. I'm bigger than you. I'm meaner than any of you. I'm smarter than any of you. And then she added, So there. And she is very large. She's very large compared to little Watney. With that, she accidentally, on purpose, elbowed an ear, bumped two noses, stepped on three tails, and lay down on a desk. Fur prickled in fear throughout the classroom. She sure was bigger than any of them. She sure looked meaner than any of them. Was she smarter than any of them? What's two plus two? asked Miss Fuzzleworth. Four, shouted Camilla Capybara without even bothering to raise her paw. And furthermore, four plus four is eight. Eight plus eight is sixteen. And 243 plus 125 is 368. Later, when Miss Fuzzleworth asked, what's the capital of... Camilla interrupted, New York, Albany, population 295,594. And during science, in answer to the question, what part of plant is below the ground, Camilla Capybara danced in her desk and sang, Root, root, rooty toot toot. Yep, thought all the other rodents. She's smarter than we are too. And they felt very, very uncomfortable. Every afternoon, just before final recess, Miss Fuzzleworth drew a name from her hat to see who would be the leader for their favorite game, Simon Says. She scrunched her eyes closed and she jiggled the hat. Would it be Harry Hamster? Many Feet Mouse? Grizzle Frizz Guinea Pig? Could it be Big Mean Smart Camilla Capybara? Miss Fuzzleworth's paw reached in and pulled out the name of... Wadney Watt. The bell rang and there was a wild scurry for the door and Camilla Capybara was the first on the playground, having trampled the others in her path. To Wadney, she looked especially scary. She's very scary looking. What would she do when she heard him speak? Breathe capybara breath in his face? Or tie him up in his own tail? Or even pounce on him? Gosh, I hope she doesn't pounce. The tiny trembling leader of the game stood before the eager players, his head well inside his jacket, and squeaked, 
one, he says, weed the sign. While the other rodents read, P.S. 142 Elementary School for Rodents, Camilla began pulling up weeds around the sign and wildly flinging them hither and yon until she was clear up to her teeth in dirt. And the other rodents began to smile. Wadney says, wrap your paws around your head. He peeked a little peek out of his jacket and saw, whap, whap, whapity, whapity, slappity, whap. Camilla was whapping her paws around her head so hard she became dizzy, gave herself a headache, and had to sit down. The other rodents couldn't stop giggling. She's beat herself silly. Silly. Wadney says, play Wing Around the Woesy. Camilla put her arms like wings and made airplane noises. No, no. But where was the woesy? What was the woesy? I don't know what the woesy was, do you? By now, Wadney's voice was stronger and his head was entirely out of his jacket. Wake the leaves! Nobody moved. Wadney says, wake the leaves! While Harry, Minifit, Grizzle Frizz, and the others busied themselves raking, Camilla Capybar grabbed one leaf. Wake up, she yelled. She snatched another one. Come on, you, up, up, up. And another, rise and shine. And another, boo. By now, all the other rodents were squealing with laughter, all but Camilla, who frowned. Stupid leaves, they don't wake up. And... Why was everybody laughing at her? They were bullies. In a voice so strong, he had to hold his own ears. Wadney called. Wadney says, go west. The rodents collapsed in a happy heap for a rest. Go west. Camilla Capybara, feeling very smart that she could tell directions by the sun, said, all right, I shall go west. And then she added, so there. West she stomped forever and ever. She was gone. And from that day on, the pupils of PS 142 Elementary School for Rodents never teased Wadney again. He was their hero. Hooray for Wadney Watt, they cried. Woot, woot, wooty toot toot. And we love Wadney Wack.